New Journal and Guide. Subscribe today. I'm Dr. E. Faye Williams, and I'm so excited to be here in Virginia Beach, Virginia, this evening to speak to the NAACP and its uh, members who've come in for the banquet and all of their guests. You know, freedom is not free, which is the theme of the banquet this evening. The fight continues, and it does. We had so many ancestors who gave their lives, who gave their blood, their sweat, and their tears so that we might have the right to vote. So our people really don't have the right not to go out and vote. There is so much yet to be done. I know that in 2008, this country elected Barack Obama to be our president, the first African American. But you know what? People thought that race would no longer be an issue, but it is. It just seems that after he was elected, even some black people thought that the president would wave some kind of magic wand and all of our problems would be over. But little did they know that at the time that he was being inaugurated, there were people in the other party right down the street from where he was having the inauguration. They were plotting to make sure that he was a one-term president. And they've said that verbally. It's no secret. So we know that he had all kinds of pushback. But you know what? Just like our ancestors years ago, he has done many things, so many things. He has brought about the change and the hope in our community and the Latino community among women and so many others. So we're really excited to be talking about reelecting this president because there's never been one like him before. When he came into office, he immediately began to work for the poor, for the middle class, and for all people who were marginalized or disenfranchised. What has happened to show that the, we still have the fight for freedom is this voter suppression that we're experiencing all across the country. We have to be very careful on Tuesday. And I'm very pleased that the legal community is out there monitoring. The Department of Justice will be out there monitoring. So no one should fear being prevented from voting on some you know, fake reason. We know that there are groups out there that will try to prevent us from uh, voting. But as hard as our ancestors work for us to vote, it's time for us to get up and to do our part now and then know that the fight continues and we're responsible for carrying on that fight. This production has been brought to you by Image Entertainment in partnership with New Journal and Guide. Subscribe today.